Blakely with Everyday Gourmet and I'm so excited. I have teamed up with Panasonic to show you the Panasonic 4-in-1 Multi Oven Microwave and all of its amazing features. We're talking air fryer, we're talking broiler, we're talking convection oven and microwave and I'm going to show you two recipes all made in this. Super easy. I'm going to show you exactly how to do it. So the first recipe I'm going to be doing is the mac and cheese on the Get Drop app. So easy. So first thing I'm gonna do is start with all the ingredients and then microwave and let's get started. So we're gonna put all of our ingredients, like the Get Drop app said, into our microwave safe dish here. Right in here. And I'm gonna put it in our microwave. All right, I'm gonna set the microwave for two minutes and push start. All right, done. Take this out. Now with this Panasonic Home Chef NN-CD87KS, this is actually an inverter microwave, so that means you're not gonna have any of those irregular hot spots. It is all going to be delicious and perfectly cooked every time. A little pinch of salt here. So I have two cups of my macaroni, just like my Get Drop app said. I'm going to stir this all together. This is going to be so delicious. And how easy is this? It takes so much time out of making it. So I have a glass little pie plate here. I'm going to pour all of this goodness right in here. I'm gonna do a nice little topping of some panko breadcrumbs. Just like this. And a little bit of some paprika for some color and some flavor. This is gonna be delicious, I can tell. All right, so now it's time for the second part of this. I'm going to do it in the air fry broil combo. So it has a wire rack here. So I'm gonna add this right in here. I mean, you have 1.2 cubic feet of space in here. So you can fit just about anything in here. So time to do that. So now we're going to set this to an air fry broil combo. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna use combo one here for this and we're gonna make it for three minutes push start. And what's amazing about this with this air fryer, it cooks from the outside in so it gets that crispiness that you love with traditional mac and cheese. And it has the broiler which makes it crispy on the top and kind of melts all that cheese and it's going to be so good. I'm so excited. It is done. It smells amazing. I can't wait to try this. <gasps> Yum! Mac and cheese done in no time at all. So I have been scrolling and I have decided I'm going to make this plant-based meat lasagna from the Drop app. And I'm going to get started. It doesn't look that hard. Here we go. All right, so in here I have like some onion. I'm going to do some olive oil. So instead of sauteing on a saute pan, I'm going to do it everything in here and it's gonna come out just so good. So excited. So I have my wire rack in here. Put this right in here. All right, we're gonna set this to combo one, eight minutes. That's it. And add these onions directly into our meat mixture. Oh, I'm sorry, plant-based meat mixture, which I'm really excited about. And then I'm gonna do a bunch of different spices in here. So I'm gonna mix this all together. And I'm going to put it into here. And we're gonna microwave this for seven minutes. So everything's ready. In here I have a mixture of mozzarella, ricotta, some asiago. So now I'm gonna go ahead and in my ceramic microwave proof, dish. I'm going to add half of this right in the bottom. 
I'll do a layer of my meat mixture right here. Okay, so not only can you air fry, you can broil, you can microwave, you can also bake. So there's four functions with this amazing Panasonic Home Chef. So this ranges anywhere from 100 to 425 degrees, which means you could basically bake anything in here. So we're gonna do 375 for 30 minutes. Yep, it can go that long. And that's what we're doing, easy. So how easy is that? I have amazing mac and cheese. I have amazing vegetable meat lasagna here and it was so easy to do. Super simple, this is all great. I can't wait for you to try it. I highly recommend this. If you have any questions about it, feel free to write in the comment section. I'll get back to you. So there you have it. And don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to Everyday Gourmet with Blakely for more delicious recipes and videos.